and welcome to the Daily Digestion channel. Today, I am doing something different. I'm eat, I ate watermelon earlier, and now I have had my iodine, and um, I've been really super busy cleaning house, and I started my period. Oh my gosh, and I feel like I'm dying. <laughs> so, I've decided to do something different. And what I'm gonna do is I'm eating oatmeal with a little bit of soy milk. And guys, this is just plain Jane oatmeal. Check it out. I got it at Aldi's, it was super duper cheap, and it is not organic. But I have got some good news. I'm going to put some blackstrap molasses in it and I'm going to try, try to take three tablespoons of this stuff a day. I'm almost currently out, which is not really a good idea, so I'm gonna have to go get some more. But it's kind of expensive, but it's supposed to reverse gray hair, and as you can see, I have gray hair. I have a lot of gray hair, and it is coming in more and more, and it just seemed like, um, after my bicycle wreck, um, that my gray hair started coming back in quite a bit more. And it might be due to the fact that I quit using hair color. <laughs> Go figure. So I'm sure that had a lot to do with it, but I didn't realize how um, dark, I mean, how gray it was. So long story short, um, I am going to put some black stripe molasses in there. It's supposed to reverse gray hair and I'm going to document it. I'm going to do this every single day and then we're going to compare the results and see what happens. And I may even put it on there topically, um, but I'm going to do more videos on it and stuff. But also right now I'm taking some ashwagandha with my oatmeal and I'm taking 2B complex with my oatmeal and I'm taking a calcium with my oatmeal. So I need some nutrients. I'm feeling tired. I'm feeling weak and I think that this will really give me a boost. Um, there's a lot of stuff in the oatmeal. I mean in this um, in one tablespoon. There's basically magnesium, calcium, B6, um, there's potassium, and iron. It's 20% iron in just one tablespoon. And guys, usually when you take iron supplements, it constipates you, but when you take it in this, it doesn't. It helps you to go to the bathroom. So this is a win-win situation and it's a really clean fuel. I think it's really gonna help with the um, oatmeal. We'll see how it goes. I'm eating something heavy in the middle of the day. Oh God, we'll see what happens. to show my sorbetto before I ate it, but I actually didn't. I actually licked it a whole bunch, but here it is. Doesn't it look beautiful? This is green apple. Let's 
trying to show it in the light. This is green apple. And oh my God, it, it's, it's heaven. It's heaven on earth. But I'm gonna go get my black strap molasses and I'm going to, I'm going to, um, I'm going to suckle this. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm going to lick on this on my way and eat it on my way to the store because I've got to hurry. My dad's coming to visit tomorrow and my house is a wreck as usual. So actually we're getting a handle on it's cleaner than it's ever been since my bike wreck. So yay! I will talk to you in a little bit. Okay guys, I'm reporting this and I know I shouldn't be eating it. God, I'm like OCD on sugar right now, but hey, I'm going to eat a green salad tonight, okay? So that's going to make everything okay. Because like I just went shopping and I seriously cannot believe it but I was able to actually run through the grocery store I was able to do ballet while I was putting my groceries in the car like I remember last year trying to go to the grocery store after my bike wreck. Guys, it was a major ordeal. Like, I mean, I am so much better now. I cannot believe it. Like, my organs are back in place where they go. And going to the bathroom, like, has never been better. My like before my bicycle wreck, I was having issues. And that's probably what brought it on. But now, man, everything is great. Like, it's like, I'm just, I feel so good now that my digestion is so great and so amazing. Like I can eat oatmeal in the middle of the day and everything's okay like I finally figured it out too that's another thing like it I really had to dig in deep and pray like I was on my mat laying meditating praying like God show me the way how do I do this how can I eat and let my body work like there was there's a rhythm to it there is a rhythm to eating and pooping and breathing and living and working. Like it's not just you shove a bunch of face in your food whenever you freaking feel like it and you eat whatever you want whenever you want. It's not like that. Like there is a rhythm and a rhyme to the reason and to the beat of the drum. I know that probably didn't make any sense whatsoever. But I'm just saying guys, if there's anybody out there that is going to hear this message and you can pick up what I'm laying down, as Tammy Raw says, you know, like, figure it out. What is your rhyme? What is your reason? What is your game? What is your season? Like, truly, food combining is huge. Timing is huge. No, you gotta know what your digestion is. Like typically, if you look stuff up online, oh, it takes blah, blah, blah minutes to digest watermelon. Well guys, for you to digest watermelon, it may take longer, you know why? Cause you may have some crap in your pockets of your colon that is like slowing some crap down. This stuff gets stuck and it takes a long time to move maneuver around it. Guys, 
I really believe that there were things in my colon, and I mean small and large intestines. I'm not just talking about colon. I'm talking about small intestines. There were some things that were lodged. There was some coatings of thick stuff that had to be removed. And guys, it, it, it wasn't easy. It took time. It took a slow process. Things don't happen overnight. And it can be painful. And it can be it can be slow and arduous. But if you stick with it, and I mean really truly stick with it and pray and and say, I'm not gonna give up. I'm not gonna give up. And if you screw up, that's okay too. You can always go back always go back to where you were at and it's okay okay so I just took a wrong turn so I'm gonna get off here now <laughs> okay. okay guys I know it's late it's 10 49 I'm eating a cliff bar because I need to take my vitamins. Um, when you take your vitamins, you are supposed to take them with food. So, in order to take my vitamins, I'm going to eat this cliff bar, which is a really good excuse to eat a cliff bar because who are we kidding? The cliff bars are really good, especially the chocolate peanut butter, even though I just found out from High Carb Hannah. She did a special on how to um, make your very own Cliff Bars. And she did like a review on the Cliff Bars of how bad they are for you because they have the protein, I the soy isolate in it, which I didn't know. I have not researched that yet, but needless to say, I've cut down on my Cliff Bar eating and this is the first one I've had this week. So since I've watched the videos, so and I'm just eating this to take it with my vitamins. So cutting down on the cliff bars and just gonna start eating more oatmeal with uh, some black strap molasses in it since that's supposed to reverse my gray hair. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, it's kind of been a crazy day. And I uh, hope to see you in the next one. Good night. There's my feet. <laughs>